Well, hello everyone and welcome back here to Street Talk. We are at El Capo restaurant for Trump Fridays and I'm here with Robbie. Robbie and Robbie Ann. Robbie Ann, how are you? <laughs> I'm great. Great, and we are having a great time here. You know, every Friday, we're here from six until nine o'clock. People are eating, they're drinking, they're meeting friends. They're and having here, fun. Yes, and here you are. Here I am, having so what, fun. What's your favorite part of, street, of uh, being here at the El Capo restaurant for uh, Trump Fridays? Okay, besides the food is absolutely phenomenal. It is good. And yeah. the drinks are always good, the wine is always good, but, you know, you get to be around people who are uh, like-minded thinkers. So it's just nice to be around people who think like I do. Absolutely. Now, was there anything that ever surprised you? Maybe you heard something from somebody, somebody you weren't sure if they were supporting our president, and all of a sudden it just came out and you're like, I never knew that. No. <laughs> So all of I your friends, I, I must be meeting all the right people because, oh, wait, did I say right? Right. Yes. All the right people. The I right get it. People. Did you get that? I think everybody got that one. <laughs> all right. Now, Robbie, where are you? Robbie Ann, where are you from? Scottsdale. Scottsdale, north, south, east, west. Um, right around in this neighborhood, actually. Wow. You're a yes. peep. I'm you were here. So now during the week, do you also like to come to this restaurant? Uh, I do come here quite often. <laughs> Do you like the gelato? Uh, I don't have the gelato, but I have the, like, the garlic knots. Oh, they're so terrible. For but dessert? They're so good. No. <laughs> oh, they're so good. Well, I'll tell you what, it is so much fun, and you have a couple friends over there. Who's uh, here with I you? I do. Um, my friend Karen is with me, and um, her friend, so, you know, maybe they'll give you some better insight, too. <laughs> But well, it's I think they great want to be here. Yeah, it is awesome, huh? It is. All right, now are you looking forward to the upcoming election? Um, am I looking forward to it? I am not necessarily looking forward to it because I feel like our country will be in turmoil no matter what. So, yeah. even if although I'm voting for Trump, uh you just don't know what our country's going to do. You know, the, everything's in flames, the uh, riots and the, you know, the disgrace. Right. But then if a Biden and Kamala are elected, will that be the same? I don't know. So I don't know that we're, we're in for much le less unrest for a while. Well, I'll tell you what, I think the most important thing you can do is get out there and vote. Don't vote. just sit oh, wait, back. Wait, wait, wait. Don't don't vote. Vote by person. Don't vote by mail, people. Yeah. Don't vote by mail. You don't know what that means and if you don't, you need to google it and you need to understand what it means clearly because if the votes are done by mail, then that means that they have to be verified twice, twice with your verification. And so if that takes a long time and it takes after January 20th, then that means that the Speaker of the House will be become the president, interim president. Oh wait, do we all know and understand what that means? That is Nancy Pelosi will be our president until it is decided. And then by that time, Biden will then be, oh, that's right, made medically inclined. And so that way, oh, that's why Kamala Harris will then be our president. So get ready, socialists, here we come. Wow, that's a lot to think about, Robbie did Ann. I say I'll that tell very you. Clearly you did it. That's all from my mind. Well, I think hands. everybody was listening to every Ooh, single word you were saying. Yeah. No, that's it's awesome. Clear. And that's why we have Street Talk here every week at Trump Fridays here, El Capo Restaurant. And I'll Robbie be here Ann. Next Friday. Are you going to be here? Of course. All right, so all your fans oh, wait, can no, come wait. out and ask for an uh, autograph. Oh, no, wait, I will be here next Friday. It will be the next Friday I won't be because I have to. Work. All right. Well, I think everybody's writing it down at home. <laughs> All right. So until next time, thanks for joining us here. I'm Ray Michaels. I'm your state senate candidate for LD24 as well. And on behalf of Robbie Ann, we'll see you real soon. Thank you very much for listening to me. <laughs>